for tuning in to Let's Talk About It Media 21. I hope you're having a great day. Stay positive, stay focused. Let's get to it. What is the hot topic that's going on on YouTube or Instagram? Copyright disclaimer under Section 107 of the Copyright Act of 1976, allowances made for fair use for purposes such as criticism, comma, comments, comma, news reporting, comma, teaching, comma, scholarships and research. Fair use is use permitted by copyright statute that might otherwise be infringing. All comments are alleged, in our opinion, and for entertainment purposes only. Don't forget, the Cash App is Let's Talk About It Media. Thank you for all your love and support. So don't forget to like, to comment, but be kind, and also turn on the notification bell. Let's get to some Jada and Will backstory history. Do you remember when Kevin Samuels went in in regards to Will and Jada's peak as life, situationship, the relationship, and then Willow writing a letter to alleged Tupac who had passed? She was a young age, but she still wrote a letter. Many people said Jada had a lot of sadness, and for some odd reason, she could not appreciate what was in front of her. She was only focused on what has been, who has passed. R.I.P. to Tupac, R.I.P. to Kevin Samuels. Let's get to the clip. I think I'll play it from my other phone so that way you can hear his response. I had a new microphone, did not work at all. So let's, I'm gonna, oh, I was supposed to do that. Well, let's see. That's probably gonna, let me see. That might stay there. <laughs> Figuring out my phones. Okay. We're going to play the clip in regards to what Kevin Samuels had to say. I want y'all to fully hear what he said and how he responded in regards to what was going on with Will and Jada. And many people were concerned in regards to basically also making your daughter sad because for a man that's not here. Hollywood, squeaky clean image. Women love you around the world, and this is what's going on in your house. Your wife is in love with a dead man. Did, did Tupac, I know you are alive someplace. I think my mommy really misses you. Can you please come back? Can you come back so me and my mommy can be happy? I wish you were here. I really do. Tupac got killed in, what, 95, 96? Willow never met Tupac. Why is this little girl writing a letter to Tupac? Why is Will Smith's daughter writing a letter to Tupac? What is being said in that house to get this little girl not writing Santa Claus, not writing the Easter Bunny, writing Tupac? So yeah, many people feel that Jada, Jada Pika Smith, transferred her alleged sadness, her health concerns, allegedly to the children. Now, mind you, many people are saying that the kids at a young age wanted to move out, wanted to move out, didn't want to be around the whole situation shit. It's very clear that Will Smith was married to someone that was sad, didn't appreciate. I'm not certain why she didn't get more medical help or assistance in regards to care. It just seems as if, remember how Will had said, Jada, I can't make you happy and I'm done trying. I'm not even going to try to assist in making you happy. Being him there, the condition that he was in and having to leave him there. <clears throat> and um, he was in, he was, he was in, a, he was, he was, he was in bad shape. And so when he asked me to get married, he was at Rikers. And I knew at that time that, A, he needed somebody to do time with him, mm. which I was going to do anyway. He didn't have to marry me to do time with him. Right. Mm. I'm, I'm here. I see why we love you. <laughs> and then to, um, but he needed a rock. He needed, uh, because of our friendship and because of everything we had been through together, he just wanted 
to feel that solidified foundation, you know, because I promise you, he would have married me and divorced me as soon as he said his last He would have. Right. I'll be real with it. Right. Because so many people in that position don't have support. Right. None at all. None. You know? And so when you listen to the book, they were very close at a younger age. Then they became grown adults. They start going into movies. He had asked her to be in certain movies. I'm just going to be general. But yeah, a lot of times, are was he trying to marry her in regards to con, uh, visits, you know, married person's visits, but he was dating other people, engaged to other people. <sighs> was he trying to attach his name to Jada and then that way they would let him go? What would be the reason for him to want to marry her if he was already engaged to other people, liked other people, and he did divorce the woman he did get married to, and he started dating someone else? But the biggest thing is, we understand Jada has concerns. Jada has feelings. Will has feelings. It just seems as if there's a huge cleanup in regards to Jada getting her point across and it definitely seems like Will tried to stay with a person that could not appreciate him, what he was doing, how he was doing it. It's almost like he connected himself to someone that was dragging him down in a way because of her sadness. Will's career spiked and then it just took a slight dive after, after the separation. And I remember their different posts. Uh, Jada, don't record me. You know, my Instagram is something that I do and I take it very serious. And she was still recording him. In regards to Jada, I'm not going to try and make you happy. I can't make you happy. Um, you got to figure that out on yourself. And I remember Jada making a post. And a lot of us were responded to the post. And it she talked about, and I remember, I remember being in the comments. I don't often be in the comments. I remember her saying something about being in a relationship and seeking forgiveness when stuff goes left or something. And I said, you can forgive people, but don't do anything that could hurt, harm anyone's feelings because you want people to be respectful to you and you want people to love on you, appreciate you. I remember making that comment. It was a long time ago, but Will Smith had this to, to make me happy and it's her responsibility to make her happy. And then we're going to come together and build on that happiness. Will Smith is continuing to get candid about his marriage to Jada Pinkett Smith. The 53 year old actor is featured in a new cover story for GQ and discusses the revelations in his upcoming memoir titled Will. The Philadelphia native reveals that Jada was not the only one engaging in other relationships outside of their marriage. He explains, quote, we have given each other trust and freedom with the belief that everybody has to find their own way and marriage for us can't be a prison. And I don't suggest our road for anybody. I don't suggest this road for anybody, but the experiences and the freedoms that we've given one another and the unconditional support to me is the highest definition of love. Anything that I need to make myself happy, I will present that to my wife that I need that to be happy. Divorce is ability to make me happy and it's her responsibility to make her. And they've already said divorce wasn't an option. What was this? Is Will interested in still going on this roller coaster with Jada Pika Smith? I don't know. I feel for the children because it's out in regards to Jada's sadness, in regards to Jada lighting up when she talks about Tupac, but concerns and sadness when she talks about her life for the last 20 something years. Well wishes. Everyone have a great day.